and welcome back to Let's Play Pikmin 2. Alright, so we have three caves we need to get done. Let's go do one of them right now. So yeah, I think I've decided, I'm just going to get it out of the way right now. We're going to go do the submerged castle. It's the, uh, it's the shortest cave in the area, but it's also one of the scarier ones. So I'm just going to get it out of the way now. Also, this is going to be a one episode thing no matter what. I know I mentioned it last time, but I kind of want to try to fit all these caves into a single episode, just to kind of keep the pacing up. This cave, though, it's actually relatively short. And not exactly in a good way. We'll see. We'll see once we get there. Okay. So if we're going to be doing this, we need blue Pikmin. And that's all we need, because this cave is underwater, so we can bring nothing but blue Pikmin. And for once, I actually don't want a full team of 100. In this case, I want a team of around... I was thinking either around 70 or 80. Let's go around 80. 80 blue should be enough. We want to make sure we have plenty of room in our uh, party. Just so that we can recruit some Baldmen while we're in there. Because Baldmen are going to be very helpful. Okay. So we want to head all the way over here to the submerged castle and get that done. If I lose some pick, ooh, oh god, okay. I don't want to, I don't want to risk losing any Pikmin along the way. How did you already lose flower status? Here we go. No, get over here. Forget the enemies, just move. You know what? Screw it. Just kill them. Okay, I some stop grabbing things. I don't know why my Pikmin are suddenly becoming super like non disobedient. It's, oh god. I cannot aim right now, apparently. I already lost a Pikmin along the way. Great. Well anyways, yeah, it feels like they just randomly stop listening to me. I don't know why. They just split off from the main party. You know what? They just like to split off from the main party and just go do their own thing. It's weird. But yeah, as long as we have over 70 blues, I'm fine with that. Let's just make a run for it. You know what? 75 is good. Let's go. Because I believe the maximum amount of, uh, what we can recruit in this one are... Around 30, I believe. Either way, 75 is plenty of Pikmin. Alright, so this cave has a gimmick. Well, for one thing, the gimmick is that we can only bring blue Pikmin. But the other gimmick is, we need to be a little careful here. We need to have, we do have other, like... Hold on. I can actually close this if I time it right. But we are on a soft time limit in this cave. That's fine, that's fine. As long as we whistle in time, we can get- we can basically put them out. Also, why am I controlling the president? But yeah, we have a soft time limit on each floor. I want to say we have around five minutes before things go to hell. Speaking of going to hell, get over here. Get over here. Like I said, as long as we whistle in- oh my god. As long as we whistle in time, we can put them out immediately. So fire, honestly, is probably the least... Mm, I don't know if it's the... You know what? No, I would say it's the least, like, dangerous hazard in the area. Within reason. Ooh, okay. So the gimmick for this guy, we need to get him into the... Oh, hi. We need to get him into the water. Also, yeah, weirdly enough, going in the water does not put Pikmin out. I don't know why. Okay, we're good. But yeah, we want to be careful, but not too careful. I want to... Mm. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Everyone wait here for a second. I just need to get him into the water. Uh, this one will do, actually. Go over here. Come here real quick. Come in the water... Petrify and just swarm. Just kill it before it becomes an issue. This is why I got uh, Bitter Spray. Nice. 
All right, uh, another treasure over there. It looks like chocolate. Also, I don't know if I want to eat that cookie. Ugh. It doesn't even look like a very appealing cookie, to be honest. And it's apparently not. It's only worth 50. Oh, God. The cutscene distracted me. Okay. Anyway, no, get over here. But yeah, basically, uh, yeah, that thing was only worth 15. How about this? What's this worth? All right, exit's over there. Wait for it to go off. And then swarm. I don't know how long I've been on this floor, by the way. Am I about to hit five minutes? Okay, nothing, nothing in here is actually worth that much. I don't... Mm, I don't know if I would want to eat... Well, I guess pink chocolate could be, like, strawberry-flavored. And I do like strawberry-flavored stuff, but... I don't know if I would want to eat that, to be honest. There's still more treasure somewhere around here. Oh, it's probably over here. I really wish Olimar and the captain or the uh, president could close off these instead of having to rely on Pikmin. Okay. Treasure is not here. Nope, not here. Oh, I know what that is, though. Okay. I know exactly what these holes are for. Oh, get over here. Alright, let's bring this back. How many more treasures are on this floor? Is this the last one? I guess we could bring it back. Uh, do I even need the bodies at this point? All the treasure that we're getting is just kind of for completionist's sake. We don't actually need money anymore, to be honest. Also, I forgot how creepy the music is in this area. Oh, it's a... What is that? It looks like wood. I don't know if I... I guess it's supposed to be a donut? Uh, I don't know if I would want to eat that. Okay, we're done. Let's go. I kind of want to wait here for another second, though, just to show off what happens if you uh spend too long on any one floor. Let's get near the exit, though, before we do this. Oh, I should actually close this off. Alright, it's gotta be almost five minutes, right? This might be a huge mistake, by the way. I really should move on. But it's probably coming soon. Hmm. I'll give it another minute, because I'm pretty sure it spawns in at around five minutes on any floor. This floor was relatively easy, though. Actually, why am I wandering away from the exit? Let's run to the exit. Oh, here it comes. Hey, so, uh... Anyone who's played Pikmin remembers the Water Wraith, right? Well, this is where it comes from. And it spawns in if you're here for over five minutes on any one floor. It is completely invincible, and it will murder my Pikmin, so I need to leave. Because, yeah, we cannot attack it at all. It's the boss of the area. But yeah, that thing's going to destroy me, so I'm going to leave now. Bye! But yeah, anyone who's played Pikmin 2 remembers this dungeon just because of that. Cave. Remembers this cave just because of that. It is a pretty iconic boss, I will give it that. Okay, so five minutes on the clock. Let's go. Hi there. I don't think you were supposed to spawn right next to the entrance like that, but you know what? I'll take it. Uh, I guess take the body back. Break down this wall. 
What's the danger on this floor? Because once we start getting to like electricity and stuff, that's when things are going to get kind of dangerous. Because fire we can deal with really easily. Oops. Fire we can deal with pretty easily. It's once we start getting into like electricity and poison and stuff is where things get dangerous. There we go. Uh, can we break this open? Yes, yes we can. Perfect. How did you... How did my pigment get in there? That's the exit I don't want to leave yet. Hold on, there's another way up, right? Yes. Oh, I see what I have to do. Oh, wait, is that not what I'm supposed to do? Hold on a minute. Oh, wait, no, I'm dumb. I see now. Honestly, I kind of don't like the move fast boost for the uh, for the captains. It makes it so hard to let your pick or help your Pikmin keep up. They always fall behind. Okay, that's good. I'm not gonna worry about bodies at this point. What do we got here? I'm looking for. Ooh, that's what I'm looking for. Hold on. I am looking for bulb men over here so that I can recruit them for my party. Those guys are going to jump on me, aren't they? Oh, wait, those are poison, I think, right? Okay, well, anyways, I want these bulb men. Why are all the treasures in here like pastries? Oh no, do not kill the babies. I don't want to kill the babies. There we go. I want to recruit the babies. Because now we have something to deal with all the threats that aren't water. But yeah, this is why I left room in my party. I want to recruit Baldman so that I can just deal with any poison or electricity. Like I said, theoretically, I don't think you need them, technically. It's not a bad idea to get them, though. Oh god. poison, aren't you? No, you're fire. You know, it couldn't be that easy. That's fine, though. Like I said, fire, honestly, not that big of a threat. Also, weren't, wasn't there another one? Kill that before. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Like I said, fire, not a threat. Okay. Yeah, there is nothing but cookies down here. The submerged castle is not the place I would want to get cookies. They're also not worth very much. I guess they're one time use only, in that you eat them. All right, let's go grab the rest of our Pikmin. You know what? Get away from there. I don't need bodies at this point. Okay, um... That way, so exit's all the way on the other side. Honestly, if it comes down to it, I might just have a captain make a run for it to the uh, exit. I could also use some honey at some point. Okay, I think this is the last treasure of the area. It's another honestly kind of moldy looking donut. Alright, hurry up and take that back. Am I missing Pikmin? Yes, I am missing Pikmin. They got stuck. Let me go grab them. Yeah, I definitely need to get some honey. 
All right, how are we doing in terms of the treasure? It's on the way. I guess while we're waiting, we'll just grab these two. I hear it coming. Oh god, no! Okay, okay. Uh, it's distracted. Just go, go, go. Just grab it and go. I only lost, like, four Pikmin. Surprise! No, 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 no. I surprisingly only lost four Pikmin there. Just grab that donut and just go. I need to keep an eye on my Pikmin at all times right now. Like I said, if it comes down to it, I'm just going to make a run for the exit. That guy just literally jumped right on top of me. And all that for 40 Pokos. Seriously, I don't know what it is about the pastry textures in this game. They look disgusting. They look like either wood or really old. Which, I guess that makes sense. Alright, level 3. By the way, there's only like 5 levels on this castle, fortunately. Oh, yeah, we got electricity now. This is why I have bought- nope. Hold on. No, get over here. Because I can't deal with electricity with what- uh, with moves. Alright, go ahead and kill that. Fortunately, you are immune to electricity. Alright, good job. What do we got here? Water... Ooh, more Baldman. Alright, Baldman are now mine. Ooh, wait. Nope, Baldman are now mine. Perfect. Uh, okay. Split up. President, break down this wall. Ogomar can take the Bulbin to deal with all the other threats that uh, my blues can't deal with, like this electricity. Also this guy. I don't actually know what the Bulbin's attack power is compared to, like, normal Pikmin. I see death. Oh no, you're not death, you're fine. Anyways, what were we doing? Right. Okay, let's clear out all the electricity then. Oh wait, I heard treasure. What is that? It looks like product placement, but at least it's not edible. Seriously, what is with all the cookies down here? Did a bakery flood or something? Also, I don't know where the exit is. Mm, honestly, I might just... I'm gonna probably leave my blues behind for a little bit. Here, we'll leave him here-ish. Do I seriously only have 12? No, oh, no, a bunch of Baldwin got stuck over there. That's fine. Not that big of a deal. Okay, what is this? This is definitely product placement of some kind, right? I don't have my list up, unfortunately, but it definitely was something in the original game. Alright, what else we got here? Ugh, I need... 
I'm gonna need all my Pikmin to break down that wall. Let's clear out the area first. Uh oh. Oh, did I lose one? I lost two. Also, nice little detail, these guys don't have Pikmin souls. Okay, I should have just brought the rest of my blues, to be honest. Whatever. Didn't lose a pick. Yeah, I lost a Baldman there. Darn it! Stop breaking down the wall. We can do that later. Keep hitting the wrong button. You know what? Get down here. I'm just gonna do this a safe way for now. Oh, that hurt a lot more than I thought it would. I hear it, it's here. Where is it? Oh no! Okay, this is fine. Oh god, this is not fine anymore. Alright, uh, where's the water raid? Y you know what? Just kill that thing. It's fine. Oh, hi! I found it! Oh, no. Okay, this is fine. Just bring it back and... Oh, no. Oh, no. Well... Well, this went south very quickly. Okay, uh... Hmm. I took too long on this floor. If we can just get it all... Okay, I think it's distracted. Let's hurry up and go grab it. Oh, did I lose all of my, uh, Baldman from that? No, it looks like we still have our Baldman. Perfect. Grab the treasure. I don't care about anything else. Let's go. Where'd it go? You are not a threat. You don't have any friends to make electricity with. Okay, where did it go? You know what? I, I'm okay with losing a Pikmin or two. Because that Pikmin is dead. I'm sorry, but there's no rescuing that Pikmin. Break that, break that, break that. Yeah, I don't. That's fine. Ah, uh, where is it? Oh no, here it comes. Break it. Hurry up. Please tell me that was the last treasure on the floor. That was worth 10. We lost like 30 Pikmin for a 10, uh... Ah, uh, we good? We good? We're good. Where's the exit? Wait, where is the exit? It's over there. Great. Go. Oh my god, the pathfinding. You know what? Go! Oh no, the wall hasn't been broken down yet. Uh, okay, this is fine. I'm down to 58 Pikmin, by the way. Break it, break it, break it. Bye.
And that could have gone better. I was definitely playing it way too safe there. At this point, we just gotta accept that we're gonna lose Pikmin here. Oh, Baldman! Thank you. Uh, was there even anything over here? There was nothing over here. What was the point? Alright, where is the treasure? Um, there's treasure somewhere around here. Ah, it's a bomb rock. Oh, get away from that. Oh, thank God, more bald men. Nope. Uh, I lost the pick. Oh, no, no, no. I just noticed there's a bomb right there. This is fine. All right, where's the treasure? It's in here, isn't it? Wait, where's the treasure? Is that closed? That's closed. Okay. There's treasure somewhere around here. The sensor is going off. Is it buried? It can't be buried. We're we literally are not allowed to have white Pikmin in here. Oh, wait. No, that's not it. Oh, there it is! It's white chocolate. Okay, um, while they're doing that, let's break down this. Because there is no other treasure over there. Okay, while we're doing this, um... Let me go take a quick look over here, make sure there's nothing else here. Ugh, captain's not, or president's not looking too hot. Battery. Nope! Knew it. Ooh, there is treasure over there. I did not bring enough Pikmin, did I? Oh, no, I barely brought enough Pikmin. Oh, my God. Game. Just for once, can you please chill? Are we good? We're good. Uh, I kind of missed the feature in the later games where you can direct your other captain. Oh my god. You can direct your other captains via like the touch screen and stuff. Or the map. Close that. Nope. I think they're good, right? Yeah, they're good. Oh my god. It's fine. We're going to link up with the, the president in a second. Break this down. Oh, actually, no, that's fine. That's on range of anyone. Alright, that's dead. Perfect. Two of you go help that out, or a bunch of you go help that one out. Wall is broken. Oh, is that honey? I need honey. Give me that. It's one glob, but you know what? It's better than nothing. Oh. You know what? No, we're fine. Somehow that bomb missed. Alright, break that down. Oh, where's the exit? It's right over there. I'm gonna need some of you. Is there a bomb about to drop in my head? Alright, that's on the way. Bring that back, good. 
How's the exit coming along? Anyways, we got another tasty treat here, a battery. Uh, I'm guessing this was Energizer. It's a double A battery. All right, come with me. Sounds like the, okay, wait for it is open. So all we need to do is get this back to the ship and I think we're done with the floor. Right? I'm just, I hear it coming, where is it? Where is it? Wait, where is it? I heard it drop. It's somewhere around, ah, it's a bomb. Oh, there it is. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Fortunately, I don't think it's spotted me yet. Get that in there, get that in there. That's toilet paper, isn't it? That, that's toilet paper. That, no, wait, no, that's not toilet paper. That's tuna salad spray. Okay. To be fair, it looks like toilet paper. Who wraps tuna like this? Is that the last treasure? Please go gray. Please go gray. We're good. Let's go. Alright, here we go. Home stretch. This should be the final floor, right? Yep, final floor. Perfect. Okay. So now that we've hit the final floor, we're going to actually have to deal with the Water Wraith. Fortunately, the Water Wraith does have a weakness. And that weakness is the color purple. I don't know why Purple Pikmin are the Water Wraith's weakness, but they are. So yeah, we couldn't bring Purple Pikmin with us. No, don't be drink that. That's not for you. So anyways, yeah, we could not bring Purple Pikmin with us because they can't swim. Fortunately, we can just make Purple Pikmin here. I'm going to use my Baldman for this just because we can't use them after this. So we just need our purples. Actually, you know what? Uh, wait here. Let's grab our purples and give them the honey. Because these ten purple Pikmin are basically about to kill... He's not really a god so much as just a weird interdimensional water being. That is never really explained. Anyways, uh, yeah, you guys, all ten of you, you get this. This is all yours. Oh, one of them missed it. Darn it. Well, whatever. Might as well convert as many of you into flowers as possible. Just for the extra damage. Okay, let's do this. So what we want to do, I believe we want to hit it with a purple. There it is. Alright, you took out so many of my Pikmin. Now it's your turn. That's not what I meant to do. So I believe it's actually the slam that does it, right? Yep, it's a slam. Okay, technically they're more vulnerable to the shock wave than the actual, like, uh... Than the actual, like, color purple, but same thing. Alright, it's dead now. Okay, it's technically dead now. He can't kill any of our Pikmin anymore. Also, I never really remember this. Why is the water rate so thick? Like, look at that thing! Alright, just kill this thing. It's no longer a threat to me or anyone else. Uh, do I have any more purples on me? Perfect. Oh, wait, it got out of stun. Hold on. Get back here. Not so tough now without your water, your, like, rollers anymore, are you? I would feel bad for this thing if it didn't, like, take out 50 of my Pikmin in a single go. Oh, hey. Spicy spray. I'll take that. Alright, but yeah, that is, uh, that's a submerged castle out of the way. One of the more memorable caves of the game. I will give it that.
All right, let's bring this thing back and get out of here. Oh, I should probably open up the way to the exit, too. Actually, wait, is it already open? No. Ooh, but yeah, Water Wraith. I love the Water Wraith. It's just such a weird addition. I guess Pikmin in general is pretty weird. Unfortunately, we won't be able to bring the Baldman back with us, but eh, oh well. What do you mean? You are literally solid gold right now. The Pluckaphone. That's a terrible name. But yeah, basically with this we can use our whistle to harvest Pikmin, which is... Eh. It's an okay upgrade, I guess. Nothing really that spectacular. Alright, but now that we've gotten everything, let's get out of here. If I miss the treasure... I don't know if I'll come back for it, to be honest, but... I don't think I missed anything. We cleared out all the floors already. I lost 46 Pikmin. Started with like 75. I don't know if that call counts a Baldman though. Also, that was... That might have been the least profitable cave out of all of them. That was only worth 716. But hey, you know what? We got it out of the way. Now all that's left are some... Still kind of dangerous caves, but nothing super bad. All the really bad caves are in the Wistful Wild. Okay. Yeah, I'm down to 50 Pikmin, right? Oh, at least I kept all the purples. I lost 30... Okay, I only lost 35-ish Pikmin. That's not too bad. Alright, so we do have two more caves we need to do, but I think I'm going to do those next time, obviously. And by next time, I mean tomorrow. It's been a long day. I'm going to bed. We can wait a couple more days. It's fine. But yeah, I have no Pikmin with me, so I'm not worried about leaving any behind. Yeah, I lost about 30... Actually, no, I lost what? 30... I only lost 30 Pikmin. Oh, wait, no, it also... Never mind, I forgot to count the additional purples. I lost 40. You know what? Omar is probably going to be making a... He better make a pretty big bonus out of all this. Alright, but with that, uh, we'll wrap things up here then. We have two more caves to do, so two more episodes. And then it's off to the Wistful Wild to finish up the game. Also, where is it? I just want to see its entry. Also, what is... What am I missing? Oh, probably some bosses, duh. There it is. It might be a ghost. Actually, it is a raid, so it could be a ghost. I... I don't think that thing is natural, Olimar. Look at that thing. Like, I'm just gonna throw some pick pick carrots at it. Oh wow, it doesn't even react to those. But yeah, this thing is not natural. All right. But with that, we're going to wrap things up here, like I said. So next time on Let's Play Pikmin 2, we're going to head back down to the uh, perplexing pool and do another cave. I don't know which one yet. It really doesn't matter. So, till then. <laughs>